Hey guys, so I was recently shown this extremely cool method to train prayer. And if you're anything like me and you want the maximum XP per hour, you're gonna really like this. So check it out. Hey YouTube. So I decided to also make a guide about taking bones. I feel like this is a method that not many people know about, but can easily achieve you three times as much prayer XP per hour. And you can use this with any bone you want. Um, I highly suggest using a runner. I currently use run for less CC to find runners. They have the best prices and some of the coolest runners. Shout out to my guy three cover fly. So now let's jump into the bulk of it. Again, this is an extremely easy method. It just requires the tweaking of a few RuneLite plugins. For starters, you're going to want to find, search for your menu entry swapper, flick that on, and just make sure that within the item swap section, you have Barry checked off. Now we go back and search for entity hider. You want to go ahead and turn that on and edit it to make sure you're hiding players, hiding players that are in 2D, hiding NPCs, and hiding pets. You wanna make sure that you have your friends chat or your friends unselected so you can still see your runner and you can easily trade them. Runners already have these settings selected and that's how they can so easily trade you. So now let's jump into the actual method. The gist of this whole method revolves around using each bone on the altar individually. Now, we try and set up our screen and our zoom level to have our inventory ideally right next to the altar, so we're reducing the amount of mouse travel. We've also, through the menu entry swapper, have made use the first left click option, which makes this infinitely more possible. Let's go ahead and see what kind of XP per hour we can accomplish using ticking. So as you can see, we're clearly going through inventories of bones three to four times faster than what the original AFK offering method would have been able to do. Let's see what, what kind of XP per hour we can achieve ticking these superior dragon bones. Two mil prayer XP per hour is pretty unprecedented. So this is a super neat method, and this works on any bones at any altar. So you can use this at the Chaos Altar to make quicker trips and get out of the wilderness as soon as possible, or you can use this just at a regular Gilded Altar. Well guys, that's it for this guide. I hope this was helpful, and if it was, please just drop a subscribe, or leave a comment, or just simply tell me how I can improve. Regardless, thanks for watching, take care.